What's going on, you guys? Andrew Roboto here, and welcome to Five Nights at Dark Pit, where this is a game, a Nintendo fan game based off of Dark Pit, and this game is made by the Kirby Genius, and it is made in Click Team Fusion 2.5. So anyways, without further ado, we will start a new game and see what has to offer for us. And for those who don't know, Dark Pit is a character in Super Smash Bros. Oh, we have a cutscene. Okay. Press enter to continue. I work as a security guard who works the night shift at many places, mainly to raise money for my family. For the most part, it's been fun. Except for one time. You're probably wondering what that one time was. Well, it's kind of a long story. It happened in May of 2017. Specifically, the time where I was guarding the temple of the beloved goddess of light, Palatina, while she was away on vacation. Help wanted, Pal Palutina's, tem Palutina's temple. This week, Palutina, the beloved goddess of light, and Pitt, her servant Angel, are going on a seven-day vacation. They are leaving the guards of the temple the Centurions, as well as Timothy Christopher, the temple manager in charge of the place during the day. But this place is in need of a night guard to watch it during, well, night of course. During the night, the guard must watch the temple using the security cameras at night from 12 a.m. to 6 a.m. After that, the night guard will stay in one of the nearby Skyworld motels and get their well-deserved rest after each night. That makes sense because, um... Because when you're working as a night guard, you're working from 12 a.m. to 6 a.m., and that's all night, and you really need your rest after pulling an all-nighter. Anyways, in order to apply, call 1-888-1888, I mean, sorry, 1-888-SKYWORLD, reward $200.50. All right, what's next? Oh, we have another cutscene? Great, how is my plan supposed to succeed now? Hmm, what's wrong, Dark Pit? Apparently, I was wrong about us being alone in the temple each night while the staff goes to rest. They've hired someone to watch the temple during each night. I have a feeling that this security guard will somehow discover my plan and will be busted. Hmm, well, if that's the case, then I have an idea. Oh, really? What is it? Maybe once this guard shift starts, you can walk around the place to track them down. Sounds like a plan. And we are on. We have jumped into night one. All right. And that music that just played is familiar to me because um, that music that's. That soundtrack um, is the music that's played in a lot of the Horror Stories videos. Oh, we have Title and Continue. I'm assuming Title, we go back to the main menu, Continue, we start. Alright, I'll press Continue. Excuse me. Let's see what's next. Ooh, this is a nice office. Pit, the hero of Skywall. That's a pretty good description. Okay, that's to close the door, that's to check the lights. And I can't honk the nose on Pit. Hey there, welcome to the temple. I'm Timothy, and I'll be your guide for the week. This is the temple of Politana, the goddess of light. I'm the manager of the temple. I make sure everyone does their job correctly. Thanks for helping us out here. We really needed a security guard to take the job. Charge close then? Hmm, wonder what that so, does. As you might know, they're on a seven-day vacation. Oh, there's another van we can close. From their normal routines for a while. They brought the Skyworld police with them in case of any attack. Restart or generator flat. It's fun protecting land from up in the sky, you know. Now, enough about me ranting. Let's just talk about your job. Now, as you can guess, we'll be watching security cameras to keep an eye on the place to make sure nobody breaks in. This is an old place, so those cameras are cheap. Because of this, the temple has night lights in certain rooms, so you can still see them. Some rooms, however, keep the regular lights on because there are no night lights for them. Space bar to pause the slash has a unpause. System. Interesting. There are no cameras in the vents themselves because, well, we tried adding cameras into them a long time ago, 
fully gave up because they wouldn't work right. They just kept glitching out, or even worse, just straight up breaking entirely. So we decided to just not add cameras in the vents at all. Some rooms also had unique features, but I won't be explaining them tonight. I should not keep rambling for too long. Now in your office, there is a door on each side of you that has a light that's used to blind people, typically used against intruders. However, just because you blind someone with the light doesn't mean you're safe. Intruders can still get into your office and possibly attack you. That's why we have the doors. If you see someone suspicious at your door once you turn on the light, close the door immediately. Be sure to keep that teleporter button we gave to you so that you can leave at 6 a.m. once it's done charging for 6 hours. The power supply here might go down quite fast. This is mainly due to the light that I mentioned earlier. Luckily, the office lights and door lights don't use power, but the doors and monitor do. So please try to conserve as much power as you can. Oh, one more thing. Use the lights as much as you can. This is essential when someone breaks in and is coming for you. That's all. Good night, and good luck. Okay, so... Apparently, we can actually pause the game. Which is pretty cool, because this is no other FNAF game I've ever played it allows me to pause it. And we have a timer instead of a, just a generic clock for the time, which is pretty cool. The timer is actually better because then we can, because the night usually goes by a little faster, whereas a generic time it kind of goes by a little slower. Okay, I'm going to check the vents on the cameras. That's some pretty s unpleasant music. Okay, let's go check the doors. That is really suspense music. Oh, here's Dark Pet. I don't know if I should lock the door for him or something. I don't know what, what I should do here. Oh, that doesn't do anything. I don't know who we gotta lock the door for on the camera, but I think that's gonna be for the next night. I don't know if we gotta use the vents for it either. I'm assuming the vents will be for the next night, too. I'm not sure yet. Right now, I just gotta focus on the doors. Because Dark Pit, I know, is active for night one. Okay, this music is very unpleasant for a FNAF fan game. Normally it plays like regular background sounds or music, but this music is really suspense. And bone chilling too. Oh, Dark Pit, I think, is nearby, so I gotta start checking the doors. I think he's nearby. Okay, he's in the hallway, so I think he's nearby. Okay, Dark Pit is not at the doors yet, so I'm checking. Ah, Dark Pit! Okay, so Dark Pit's gonna be coming from the left door. Okay. And then I don't know who's gonna be coming from the right door, but... At least we know Dark Pit's gonna come from the left door.
and we actually have a window we can check as to see if he's still there or not. Okay, dark pit left, so that's a good thing. And the window's how we'll know if he left or not. Dark pit is not there. I'm gonna go check the cameras because I don't know if we have to use like a vent to close or something. I'm checking just to be safe because I wasn't explained that. Okay. And apparently every time Dark Pit comes from the door, he ra he raises his weapon like he's about to attack me. So, which makes sense, because, I mean, Pit and Dark Pit both have, like, a bow and arrow they use for a weapon. And so does, um, Link. Link, I know, has that, too. Okay, Dark Pit's about to come near the office soon, so I gotta check the, the lights. And we've made it to 5 a.m., so we're doing well so far. So that's a good thing. 5 a.m. is a good thing because that means we're almost at 6 a.m. And we, and, we're, and we beat the night. And once I get to 6 a.m., oh, Dark Pit is here. Okay, so I gotta close the left door since Dark Pit is there. Okay, Dark Pit left, so that's a good thing doesn't stay there that long as I thought, so that's a good thing. Yeah, and I'm not going to lie, Dark Pit's entrance theme when he comes to the door is pretty bone chilling. Alright, and we're almost at 6 a.m., so that's a good thing. There we are, night one completed. And we get that really cool music as well, when the, as, well as the alarm clock playing. So that's pretty cool that we, have, that we have a marching theme playing for the alarm clock every time we beat the night. Alright, let's see what's next. Okay, this is the... Alright, so that's the cutscene for Night 2, which, um... Which we will take on Night 2 in the next video. Thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button. Also, comment and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.